Welcome to The Soul Work. The Soul Work is a weekly show where we explore powerful strategies to break down your old conditioning and your beliefs, so you can show up as the real and authentic you in all aspects of your life. In this week's episode, we're going to explore the power of positive thinking. There was a question on the Come On In Facebook group. Does anyone use positive affirmations and do they help you? My response went like this. I used to, but I don't so much anymore. And here's why. Positive affirmations don't work if your subconscious isn't aligned with your conscious mind. Let me give you an example to illustrate this. So let's say that you use an affirmation such as money flows with ease and abundance into my life. It's one that I used to use quite frequently. Now, if you have a core belief in your subconscious, such as money is hard to get or money is the root of all evil, no amount of positive thinking is going to bring in that flow of abundance. It just won't work. I was then asked, how do you align the two? How do you align your conscious with your subconscious mind? In a nutshell, here's the process that I use. The first thing is to get clear on what it is that you're directing your positive thinking towards. So for you, is it money, is it relationships, is it health, etc. Identify what it is that you're directing your positive thinking towards. The second thing is to ask yourself, why don't I have it already? Now this is really important, you need to listen very closely to the story that you're telling yourself about this. Because underneath the story is the belief, the belief that is the root cause of it all the root cause of you not having it already. So is that belief that I'm not good enough? Is it that I'm gonna be found out? Is it that I'm not lovable? Get clear on that core belief. The third thing is then to put that belief into the spotlight. Ask yourself, is it true? And then give three pieces of evidence to support that it is true. And once you've given that evidence, then question that evidence. Why do you believe what you just said? The fourth thing is then to reflect. So what is the reality here? What does all of this tell you? In a nutshell, that's the process that I use to align my conscious with my subconscious mind. Now, I've put together a free guide for you on how to change your beliefs. If you want to find out all the detail about how I do this process, you can download it here. The address is ginabatty.com forward slash get dash started. Then what? I mean, do you use positive thinking or affirmations or something else? Or I mean, what do you do then? Well, none of that. I mean, I work on aligning the two. So once the conscious and the subconscious are aligned, there's absolutely no need for affirmations. I visualize instead once I'm all lined up. That is how to harness the power of positive thinking. The question from today's episode came from the Facebook group, the Come On In. Facebook group. If you want to join in the conversation about this with hundreds of other people all around the world, join us over on the group. We talk about the things that really matter to us on there, such as relationships, work, family, responsibilities, sexuality, gender, culture, our goals and dreams, literally anything goes. It's a thriving and nurturing group where we're all supporting each other to be real and authentic in all aspects of our lives. I'll put the link to the group in the description below. If you're interested, join us over there. And don't forget, download that free guide on how to break down those beliefs. It goes through all of the detail of the process that I take myself through to align my conscious with my subconscious mind. And if you like this video, hit the like button, share it with your friends and be sure to subscribe. I'll see you next time on The Soul Work. Thank you for watching. Have a fabulous day. Bye for now.